it's Melissa from Kiwi Banana and today I'm going to talk to you about a wee shoe issue that I had recently. So for me, my goal is to try and be more minimalist, should I say. Try and consume less, try and um, reuse the things that I do buy as much as possible. Um, I'm far from perfect and uh, it's a continuing goal that will you know, probably go on for the rest of my life. But recently, a, my boss said to me that I had to buy new shoes because the shoes that I'm wearing are not corporate enough. And I said, well, we've got ourselves a little bit of an issue because A, I'm not buying heels. I have to stand in the same place all day long for my job. And if my male colleagues don't have to wear heels, then why should I? And B, it's really hard to get good looking, good quality vegan leather shoes. I said, look, what I can do is I can have a look online and if you wait a few weeks, then we could probably, you know, I could turn up to work with some more professional looking shoes. So they seem pretty good on that and that's basically what I've done. There used to be a shop in the city centre of the place that I live in that sells like, well they sold nice, you know, reasonably priced, um, you know, Stella McCartney shoes and that was great but for some reason the shop is not there anymore, I assume that's closed down. So I had a look online and well, I'm going to show you what I got. I haven't really looked at them myself so you and I can look at them together. Right, so there's a hair. Uh, that is probably better. Move that stuff out of the way. Gosh, I'm not very good at getting these camera angles very right. And to be honest, the table's not like square, so that doesn't help either. Anyway, so I got them from these guys here. And I think it's from the UK. I wanted to get some as well that I, you know, they're just not like $20 cheap as like you know, faux leather shoes that are just going to like crap themselves. So I had a look online and these guys seem pretty good and I also didn't really want to be contributing towards like child labour and things like that as well. Um, so these ones are here. They finally arrived. So I, I did actually have in mind that I would want some Oxford style shoes and that is what I've got. And these are made in Portugal. Uh, yeah, I'm like a size 40. I've got reasonably large feet, but not like size like 42. And they they even have a little vegan label on them. I don't know if you can see that in down there. So that's quite cool. So yeah, these are going to be my new work shoes. I'm quite excited actually to turn up to work um, with some really cool looking shoes and be like, these are not made from the dead skin of a cow. So yeah. It's just the other foot. Woohoo! Lift that back up. So yeah, let me know if you've had anything like this happen to you. Have you had a scenario like this occur before where you've had to be like, like, look, this is my my ethical grounds, I'm not willing to budge on them here, but can we make a compromise in some other sort of way, like whether they just have to be more patient, etc, etc. Let me know, yeah, if you've had anything similar like that happen to you in the um, comment section down below, um, share your story. Did it work out well? Did it not work out well? Do you think if you had to deal with it again, would you do it any differently? And I hope you've done something that makes you happy today. See ya!